Hello everyone, and welcome back to Sweet Transit. So as I said in the last episode, we are going to expand our population up to 3500. And we need, uh, let's see, about... <coughs> oh, sorry. Yeah, we need about 150. Which is, let's see, 2, 4... Not too many houses. So one house can keep... Oh wait, 30, really? No, 25. Uh, let's see. So this is 50. This is 100. So I think this should be enough. Let's see. We should plateau out at exactly 3500. Yes, perfect. So, now I need to make sure that we have enough production. So, fish is perfectly enough. In fact, we are overproducing by 20, that's great. Bread, 140, uh, no, sorry, potatoes, 140. And we are making 180, that's great. Next, clothes. We are making 150 and consuming 140, that is perfect. Let's see, just make sure. We need 75 and we are making 80, that is perfect. So clothing is satisfied for now. Upkeep. Uh, that is not great. We are making 240 and upkeep is 237, so maybe I need to increase this one as well. Let's see. Yeah, 240. Mm -hmm. And we need to build one more sawmill. Let's see. Maybe I will start expanding on the other side. I will have one tree farm here. So we need a sawmill, you can go maybe here, first the storages, two more, here will be okay, and then the actual three nurseries, and let's go like this, sure, let's see. The actual passenger line. Where is it? No, no. Still no. Yeah, that's it. So this one brings in 160 workers. Hmm. Uh, let's see. This one is connected to every piece of farm. And this one is connected to the distribution center, so that's great. Mm -hmm. I don't think we are bringing enough workers. Mm, I think I will have to add, add one more uh, passenger train for this one. So, let's get one of... Maybe even a small one will be enough. Sure. So you are going on the sawmill worker line. We don't need another big train, a small one will be enough. Next up, this will take care of this. I think the lumber trains have enough throughput at this point. Production is too low. No, it's fine, don't worry. This one, production, yeah, it should be 60. Uh, let's see, the stone works are here. We have five, they are making 12. Yeah, this production is 60 on the stone works. Mm. What's wrong with the storages? Let's see. No, it's fine. I think it's just a throughput, so can I add one more train? 
Mm, I think the only way I can add one more train at this point, if I build that secondary bypass, so don't mind if I do, we are going to need... Mm, let's have it here. Sure. This one has no interaction with the main line. So, you are going to go... You know what? I think we can do this. No, wait. I need to do this. So, let's see, move this chain signal back by one. You are no longer necessary. No, come on, that's it. In fact, you can be moved up a little bit, maybe here. And we are going to have a secondary line going this way. So we are going to have one more block signal here. And this one is actually going straight into this bridge. Yes, and this bridge is hooking up... Hmm, maybe right here. So this can be turned into a block uh, chain signal. There we go. This one has to be long enough. So let's see... yeah. There's no point to have any signal in here. So, let's just make sure that they are using the correct place. So, potato farm workers from the town, you will have to go through the bridge. But after the town, so like this, yes. Sure. Then, let's see. Same goes for the potato farm deliveries. After the town, you go through the bridge. Then, the cotton farm is basically the same. After the town, you go through the, the bridge. Cotton farm workers, of course, the same, but after the town. And that will take quite a bit of load of this junction. And everything is already running more smoothly. Okay, so let's see. These guys are working fine. This is working perfectly okay. Which means, clothing, fish, potatoes, um, potatoes, okay. I think potatoes are actually suffering. You know, it would be really nice to have a more long-term production graph. This is going uh, by way too fast. Anyways, I think cotton is fine, yes. Mm -hmm. Also, what is the upkeep on stone now? 245, that's great. Okay, so I think the town is pretty stable at the moment. Let's hope it stays that way. Uh, let's see, anything else I can do before we proceed? Mm, I think that's it for now. So how many bread do we need? For bread we need 140 per minute. One bakery can make 60 per minute, so three of them will be enough. And we need... Yeah. See, uh, 180 of wheat, which we can make. Uh, production is 120. Okay, so two farms will be more than enough. Okay, good to know. Now, where can I place it? <sighs> now, this is a bit harder to decide. Also, why are you waiting? Oh yeah, there is no queue signal here. Okay, let's take care of that. So, you go away and you turn into a queue signal at 10 spaces. That's it. That should speed things up a little bit. 
So as I was saying, we need two wheat farms. Now where can I place it? Before we do that, we need to have a secondary bypass here, I think. Mm -hmm. I will move this chain signal back by one. We can delete this one. And we are going to have a secondary bypass here. I forgot. We, don't need, uh, we need the bypass not only here, but here as well. So, we are going to... We can split off for the entrance here. E no, wait. Let's get rid of this signal. And we can split off right here. And we can have this signal here. Sure. And we can have this one go straight into this line. And that line only. So, you can do... let's see... Yeah, this will be okay. Uh, do we really need... Yeah, you know what? Let's just make sure that they can access... Yeah, that's, this will be fine. And these can access this line, so that's fine. Okay, so we need a chain signal here. It has to be like this, I'm afraid. Mm -hmm. And we need a block signal in a queue formation like this. You know what, let's space it out just a little bit, like this. Okay, like this. Maybe move this one by one. Ah, good enough. So let's make sure. Mm -hmm. Sure, and now we just need to make sure that the usual suspects are using the correct... So you are going to use this track, yes. Then the cotton farm delivery. After the cotton farm, you are going to go through here. You are already going through it there, but you know, just make sure. Then the potato farm delivery as well. Again, it's already using the correct one, but need to make sure that the padding is set correctly. And the potato farm workers as well. Just like this. Okay. Now the load of the mainline is absolutely correct at this point. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this will work okay, I think. Yeah, the core train is still using this bypass. So that's, that's still helping. Mm -hmm. Sure. Let's see. Um, where can I build the wheat farm? I think I will have it up here. Which means this coal mine is going to be unused. But you know what, we have enough here, so it's fine. Speaking of coal... Yeah, we still have enough, it seems. So, let's see. First things first, we need to continue the main line. I will bring it up... this way. Just like this. What I had in mind is to connect them up here, and then have a third line going this way. In fact, we don't really need to come up all this way. We, we can connect up, up here, and then split off a third line going this way. Yeah. So let me trim this one back. Yes. I'm getting warmed up to the idea that the game is warning us if we are deleting long stretches of tracks. At first it looks like looked like a quite unnecessary feature, but I think it's actually a pretty good idea. So, let's see, you can go like this. Yeah, sure. Okay, so the main line is extended. Let's make sure... I will deal with the signaling later. 
First, let's split off. So we are going to have one line going like this. Now we have access to these bridges, so I think I will actually take advantage of that. We are going to have these two like this. Then we are going to have this one coming into this one. This one splitting off like this. Uh, let's see. Let's see, how do we deal with this one? This one is coming this way, so it has to go like this. Mm -hmm. So maybe this bridge has to be a little bit longer. Maybe this long. So you can actually go under. And you can curve back into this one like this. So this, uh, it's, it's really expensive, but you know what, it's fine. And it doesn't look like we need to pay upkeep on these bridges, so that is pretty good news. So, let's see. This one can get on this one. This one can get on this one, yes. This one can leave that way, and it can leave that way, perfect. So it looks like looks to be a free-flowing intersection. So we need chain signal here, here and here. Block signals at the exit, at the correct spacing. Yes. Again, correct spacing of 10. Also, we have some traffic already. That's good to see. Uh, Rashi. We can have some signals going this way. And three. Yeah, I will get rid of this one and maybe move this one up by one. Okay, so this one is definitely a long piece of track. So I think this one can be queued. Yes, we can have a queue signal here, which places a perfectly placed block signal here, a chain signal here. Okay, we definitely need to break up this one. This one is also a pretty long block, so I think we can... Let's see, can I make it into... Mm. For some reason it doesn't really want to turn this into a queue. Because of the bridge, I think. Ah, that's fine. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1... Uh, it's not long enough, so this one is unnecessary. We can have a chain signal here and here. We can break this one up like this. And this one like this. So, let's see. Mm -hmm. Maybe I should have it here, so another train can go tr straight through if it wants to. Also, the same goes on the other way. So if a train goes straight through, if it's another train wants to go this way, it doesn't have to wait until this whole uh, block is cleared out. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and in that case, this one can be moved back here. Yeah, I think this will do just fine. Yeah. In fact, I will do the same on this junction later as well. But for now, let's concentrate on the farm. So, we need, first things first, we need a... The usual distribution center, like that. We are going to have, of course, the obligatory road. And then we are going... Oh, uh, let's place the farms first. So as I said, we only really need two farms at this point. So we can have one 
here. Okay, these storages are pretty big. Maybe like this and this. And also they need lots of farm fields. We need to keep that in mind. Is there a configuration that gives me the correct ratio? You know what? This will be okay. And then we need to build another one. Let's have it like this. Silo, silo, silo. And the farm fields will go... Yeah, like this. Okay. Now we need to build the station itself. So the station will go like this. Then you are going to go like this. Yeah, four here and four here. And then... Then on the other side, yes. Let's not forget the footbridge. Then, the, of course, the train tracks. Now, how do we deal with this? I think I will have the main line split off maybe along this way somewhere. So something like this, and then it can come up this way. Sure. You can go like this, and then go like this. Go into the distance. Let's see. Um, I think I will have this as the entrance. So we can have this one come out this way. Uh, like this. You can connect up like so, and like so. Yes, you can just go do this, and we have plenty of space here, so I will curve like this straight away. You can come here, this is the exit, so you are going to go this way, and you are going to go this way. Signaling is pretty easy, we are going to, this is a three-way junction, so... Uh, this one and this one block signals at the exit at the correct spacing of course yes and finally yes let's break this one up into smaller blocks like this and like this yeah this is perfectly okay as usual we have Chain signals here and here, and block signals at the exit. Yes, and of course, these two. Yeah. Now, this one is a perfect place for a chain signal. Then we need one more here and one more here. Block signals at the exit. Yes. And maybe... Mm, one, two, you know what, I don't worry about this one for now. I just worry about the exit itself. Yeah, we just need to break this one up into smaller blocks. And that's it. At least I think so. Yes. So, it looks like the wheat farm is ready to go. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, we can have... Q signals going this way, let's not forget. Yeah, perfect. And we also need Q signals here. Mm -hmm. This one can, yeah, two spaces, I will delete it and maybe move this one up by one. Okay, anything else? Thankfully, we can see the signals zoomed out this far, so it's great. Yeah, I think this is okay. What problems do we have? Not enough workers. Of course, in the wheat farm, that's fine. So, let's see. We have two wheat farms. How many workers do they need? 60. Yeah, we need a big train for this one. But first, let's set up the actual lines. So, wheat farm one worker going from... 
should I do the second or the first station? Let's see which one is busier. Uh, both of them are pretty okay at this point, I think. I think I will set them on the first station. So, from the first station, with some time passed, you are going up to the wheat farm. Again, with some time passed. And that's it for this one. Then we need a, another route. Wheat farm one delivery. This will deliver wheat to the town. And as far as I can tell, we are going to use that wheat uh, in the town and the bread in the town, so we don't need to deliver anything else. So we are going from the wheat farm with some wheat condition to the first station, yes. Uh, wheat condition, yes. And I think that's it. Also, what's wrong with the stone? Okay, upkeep. 65 at this point So we need more of these I'm afraid mm -hmm. Yeah Before we release you know what we can release the trains and deal with the stone situation later In fact, I Think I said let's see how many bakeries do we need? Uh, three of them so build them right now let's see maybe like this okay first let's make sure we have yeah because we are going to need more upkeep for these guys as well i think so let's, so let's make sure we build them and then deal with the stone situation yes okay uh, yeah, I think you can go here and the storage will go mm, Here sure I'm going to go like this So you have access to everything. Yes, you are Yes, we need No production and upkeep is okay for wood Maybe the throughput is not enough Anyways, I will deal with that later. Right now, let's release the actual trains. So, let's see, we have the lines set up. First things first, I think we need a gondola for grains, right? Yes. I will start with just one and see how far that gets us. So, wheat farm delivery. Go ahead. And we need a passenger station for the workers. Wheat farm one workers build, yes. Okay, so while that one sort itself out, I will go ahead and take a look at the stone situation. So, yeah. First things first, we definitely need more stone works. Uh, let's see, it's in here. Mm -hmm. So we have 5 for 60 and we need 80. Yeah, and we need at least 2 just for the upkeep. Yeah, I will just go slowly at this point. Mm, I don't really want to uh, combine. Let's see, can I reassign? these two different storages. It looks like it's doing it automatically, that's fine. So, as I was saying, I will build a storage maybe... Uh, this looks like the industrial part of town anyway. Yeah, you can go mm, like this. I think we can move this water tower down this road maybe mm -hmm. that's fine for now so as I said I will only build two stone works now one and two I'm sure whatever and then we are going to need 
Let's see. So this was actually one to one. Mm -hmm. You know what? I will build two more quarries and then deal with. We are just going to overproduce stone. That's fine. So let's see. We have this one and we have. You know what? Let's go just go with this one. Mm hmm. Yeah. If we have to, we can just go around, which means we need to place the storages like this. And for you, the storages can go here. Sure. So this one is actually all connected, yes. And as I said, we need to upgrade this train. So yeah, this guy needs to be upgraded to this one, perfect. Uh, maybe we need to increase the stone deliveries. Mm, maybe not. But we definitely need to increase the cut stone deliveries. So we need a flat car going on the cut stone delivery line. Let's see, what is the storage now? Mm. I don't think we are dropping off enough quarried stone. Let's see, let's follow this train. So we have 200 on board. And as we arrive, we are dropping, yeah, we are dropping off everything, so that's okay. So I think we need to increase the uh, throughput of the uh, quarry stone too. So the quarry uh, delivery. Yes. Mm -hmm. So not enough workers was the problem. Mm -hmm. We are struggling with workers at this point. But that should be dealt with if we have a consistent bread delivery. So let's see. Fish, potatoes and clothes are okay, but this one is not okay. So I think we need more wheat deliveries. So wheat is on yeah, in the gondola car. So that's it. Goes on the wheat farm one deliveries. Let me guess. Oh, that's a coal mine. This is the wheat farm. It has, yeah, it has quite a bit of wheat already stored up. So if we have more consistent wheat deliveries, the bakeries can actually satisfy the whole town. Right now we don't have enough throughput. They chew through the wheat real fast. Maybe we need a third one. Mm -hmm, does look like it. Yeah, definitely. You know what? Let's see, not enough workers. Mm -hmm. Can I upgrade these houses at this point? Let's see. No, I don't think so. For that, so we have laborers, bread. I think it will require bricks, maybe. I don't know. I never reached this point yet. So, anyways, the clothes. Uh, are, is this okay? Yeah, it looks okay. So, the problem is the bread. So, we need more trains for that one. Wheat farm, this one, build. And now we are definitely struggling with this one. Actually, the problem of workers. No, wait. Mm, maybe. You know what? I will upgrade this one to the 4 car ver version. There we go. Do we have any trains in here? No. 
Are we actually unloading enough stuff? Yes, I... Oh, maybe this guy didn't. Is it because of... it? No, it, it wasn't full. So I think I will increase the wait time on the sawmill delivery, at the warehouse at least. Maybe 25 seconds. Mm-hmm. Okay. Do we have any bottlenecks? Uh, maybe this one a little bit. Yeah, this one is getting real busy. Uh, I mean, it's busy, but I think it, it can handle it. Mm -hmm. Sure. It can manage, I think. Any other place that is struggling? Not really. But we still have some worker issues. So let's see. The also at the wheat farm. Mm -hmm. Because of the distances, I think we need one more passenger train. But this one is more concerning. Let's see. Is it actually the town or the throughput? I think it's a throughput, actually. Mm, maybe not entirely. But now that lack of workers is actually spreading... Mm -hmm. This is actually a problem. Can I deal with it somehow? Let's see. So the bread is okay, no? No, not yet. How's the wheat? Mm -hmm. The lack of workers is actually an issue. Now we have maybe too many workers in the city. And they require too many goods, maybe. No, I think it's actually okay. Maybe over time this will balance out. Mm -hmm. I need to somehow manage the balance between these two stations. So let's see, this station is actually, I think, is doing okay. As long as these workers don't go away completely, it's going to be fine. So we don't have enough workers in this station, I think. Yeah, definitely. So we need to add a couple extra houses around it. Let's see, can I bridge over maybe here? No, I don't think so. Let's see what it says. It has to be three and four tiles, yeah, so it's too short. We can only go over two tracks and this counts as three. Mm-hmm. Maybe... No, definitely I cannot do it here. I can maybe pass it through here, but then I run into straight into these tracks, so that's not going to be okay. You know, are we going to have stone footbridges later? Because that would be real nice. Let's hope so. Because right now we are boxed in by these tracks. Okay, and now we are running out of fuel. Oh my god. We definitely need to increase the worker population. Okay, let's do it quickly. So, can we reach... Uh, we can do a little bit here. 
Mm, let's see. I think I need to... We can only place one worker home here. We can have four in here. A couple here. Let's see, can I go over like this? Yes, I think so. Yes. We can have two more worker homes here, here. There we go. A couple extra here. One more can go here. And now, as, as I suspected, we are low on wood upkeep. But that sh this should increase the workers going to this station. Which hopefully will sort out all these problems. Ah, let's give it some time. Let's just make sure that the actual roads are okay. So I think this one can be trimmed back. I think this one can actually go like this and we can have this water tower here. You know, just for aesthetic reasons. We don't need this road or this road. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. Now water is... Yeah, we have some water troubles here. But no more. This guy doesn't have water, but now it does. What about market access? Mm, that is okay. Church access. Mm, this guy doesn't have. But I don't want to increase any upkeep right now. Because as you can see, we are struggling. So, how is this one? So, okay, potatoes are now completely empty. That's not good. Mm, I think it's because of the fuel. So, let's see. Oh, no, wait. Hmm. What is the problem with coal? Maybe this will sort it out. This last delivery, maybe? No, it's still going between 4 and 6. Mm hmm. Which trains are struggling actually? Oh yeah, we don't have any coal deliveries to the wheat farm. So I think we can, because at long distance they will run out before they arrive. So that can actually be a big problem. So let's see, I think I will hook it up to the first coal delivery line. Go from, yeah, from the coal mine straight to the wheat farm first. So wheat farm first and then go to the sawmill, and then to the warehouse, and then go to the warehouse, uh, the coal mine. Okay, so this will sort this one out at least. Yeah, so the wheat trains will not take a long, uh, big refuel from here, so maybe that will help out a little bit. This is not going to, not going, doing great. We actually have enough coal, so that's fine. Let me just color things a little bit better. So, coal is actually going to be black. 
Yes. Can I save? Yes, I can. So I will save black as this color. There we go. So this is okay. Black on this one. And call my workers as well. Next up, the cotton form. I think I will have it white, but maybe a bit grayish white. Sure. So cotton form, cotton form workers as well. Next up. Okay, that's it for now. Let's keep an eye on it. Okay, so the fuel is now only two trains are struggling with, which is the cotton farm for some reason. But this is definitely an improvement. Let's see. So the consumption is 157 and the production is 180 in theory. And we have enough uh, potatoes at the potato station, so... Okay, this is... an issue. Actually, down to the lack of workers, let's see. So I think the second station has enough workers to deal with most things, but not the first one. Mm -hmm. Yes, definitely the first station is struggling with the number of workers. How can I help you help out there? Also, now we are struggling with clothes. Uh -huh. How can I deal with this issue? I think I will need to rearrange these tracks a little bit. So, let's see. What I need to do is make this a tighter turn. So, first things first. You have to go away. You will have to make a tight curve like this. Uh, let's see, like so. Mm-hmm. So a chain signal goes in here and then block signals can go here. So this will be okay. And now we still cannot really, this one has to go up, down by one. So let's see, you have to go, let's see, let's bring it out by one and then yes like this sure I think this will be okay like this no 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 like this <clears throat> so again chain signal goes here block signals go here so far so good and then we are going to have a footbridge going over here oh come on we don't have wood maybe the one delivery yes and then we are going to have another footbridge uh, can i have it here after wood delivery please any second now. Come on, please. Just one delivery of wood. There we go. So I think 
passengers can go over here. So, can we reach? How far can we reach? Let's just have a street going this way. Eh, not enough. Mm, that's better than nothing, I think. So, let's have a couple extra houses here. Like... Yeah, this will be okay. Let's just have one more wood delivery. There we go. So we can trip this road back a little bit. Maybe have a water tower here. Yeah, we need market access as well. Market access, I mean. So you have one road here. Water tower can go here and the market can go here. Yeah, as soon as we have wood. <coughs> Any second now. Come on. There, thank you. Okay. Maybe I should do the same thing on this side. Let's see, can I squeeze in any more houses somewhere? Here maybe? No. But maybe... Maybe we can have a couple this way. Maybe like this. Yes, I think so. So this is the end of the train station coverage. So we can have one here. We can have two more here. As soon as we get some wood. There we go. So, what about water? You can go here. Market. Market is fine. we are still struggling. I think we don't need so drastic remodeling on this side. We can just trim this one back a little bit. Get rid of these decorations. And I think we can do this. Then bring it up like this and like this. Mm hmm We can have the block signal here and we can just go over the tracks like this. So as soon as we get another wood delivery, there we go. We can have more buildings this way. Uh, let's see, this one is actually closer to the station, I think. Let's see how far this goes. Ah, uh, that's it. Oh my god. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is not the most optimal thing in the world. Right now I'm, I am grasping at straws basically. So, let's see. There we go. Some houses. Some water. That's it. Might as well trim this road back. Do we have market access? Yes, we do. Yeah, not, the population is actually decreasing. Mm -hmm. We are slightly underproducing the fish. So, let's just take care of that first. At least keep the bare essentials going. Oh, any second now, there we go. So the fish at least is taken care of. The potatoes, okay. 
169, nice, except not nice. So 60, the overall production should be okay. The problem at this point is actually fuel. How can I deal with that? We have plenty of coal in the coal station. Okay, where are we lacking coal? In the town itself, I think. So I think I will add one more coal delivery car to the second one, I think. Let's make sure. So this one is the coal delivery, yes. As soon as we have some coal in the warehouse, Okay. So we have enough coal, but not where we need it. That is not good. Okay, you know what? I think I will shut down the wheat deliveries. Yeah. So every train on the wheat worker no no yes this one as well so you my friend you are going in the train depot and as soon as everything else is sorted out you guys can resume but for now you guys are more problem than you are worth So uh, this should actually help things out quite a bit. After this I will troubleshoot everything else. But for that I think I will have to wait for the next episode. Yeah we are way over time. So if you don't mind I will leave it at this for now. So yeah thank you for watching. If you liked the video you can leave a like, leave a comment and maybe subscribe to the channel if you want. And until next time, I will see you later. Bye-bye.